Don't wanna grow another day Run around and always play You're Jack Sparrow and I'm a dinosaur Hello and welcome to another weekend vlog. So I am actually at Stanford Airport and I'm about to fly home for the weekend. So it is um, Thursday evening. I've just come straight from work and I've just been chilling down by the gates um, editing some Disney vlogs actually. So by the time this goes up, there will actually be some Walt Disney World and Shanghai vlogs, some new ones, which if you've been following along with my channel is quite an achievement because it has been quite a while since there have been um, any of those vlogs because I had a hard drive crash and all sorts. So you can check out my um, channel update if you want to know more about that. But yes, I finished editing, re-editing some of the vlogs. So both Shanghai and Walt Disney World vlogs are back, yay! Um, but yes, I'm going home. I'm going home to Dublin for the weekend. I'm working from home tomorrow from Ireland and then yeah, just spending the rest of the weekend at home. Which means I get to see my family and I get to see friends. But most importantly, I get to see the lovely little pug puppy that is Buzz. So I am absolutely ecstatic. I can't wait. I'm so excited. <laughs> and wait until you see I'm going to film like when I get home because he gets super excited when people come in. So I think that'd be really cool to film. But yes, I think they've just called boarding on my gate. So I'm going to head down there. So as you will have seen, Buzz was very excited to see me when I got home, which was really nice. Um, it is a bit later now. It is coming up to midnight and I am exhausted. I don't know what it is about traveling, but it just really takes it out of me. Um, even though it's only an hour flight back from London to Dublin, I'm just always really tired when I get back. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get myself off to bed and I will see you in the morning. Good morning. So it is like a Friday morning and I am working from home, which is great. But I'm about to go in and say good morning to Buzz. Hi, Rachel. Uh, <laughs> Rachel was out last night, which is why she was not in the house. I don't gotta say, which is why she looks sick. Like <laughs> <laughs> you look fine. Hello. Okay, let's, let's say That's hi to Buzz. Be. Hello. Oh, good stretching. Good stretching. You're ready to go. <laughs> he is ready to go. Look. Hello. Can I help you? Hello. Look how excited he is. Hi. Good morning. Oh, you oh, smell very bad. You need a bath. You need a bath, you smelly dog. Is that a yawn or a cry, Buzz? <laughs> Let's get you out, eh? So I've just put the kettle on. I'm just about to click now. Um, because what we do with Buzz's food is that it goes into um, some hot water. There's the cat back there. It goes into some hot water and um, then we let it cool and give it to him so it's nice and soft so he can eat it. And it's. Whoa! What was that? So it's um, rather windy outside. Oh, now that I put the camera out, it's gone real quiet. Now it just looks like we're lazy and didn't go for a run. <laughs> It's, it was pretty crazy this morning. It was like raining and it was like super blustery and windy. So we decided to hold on on the run. Um, and I guess what, we'll try and go at the end of the day. Yeah. When I finish work. And then we're getting Chinese later, yay. Hi Buzz. Yeah, you're getting us Chinese. Yeah. 
we have this little um we have this little tradition in our family when somebody gets um a promotion or a new job they have to buy everybody a chinese i don't know how it started but um it's definitely tradition so rachel actually got a promotion so um she is gonna buy us all chinese <laughs> sorry buzz is going crazy down here Bye. he knows his food is coming that's what it is is your food on the way oh there we go have you got food on the way buzz is that why you're sitting down patiently yeah yeah oh <laughs> are we excited oh, i think we're a little impatient it's too hot buzz we have to wait a minute he doesn't understand look at those sad eyes but i'm sitting <laughs> Look what I have. It's food. Oh, oh, I'd stay sitting if I were you. Stay sitting. Stay. Go on then. It's a little bit later on in the day. We actually went for a run at lunchtime um, and then the storm came like on our way back, didn't it? It was like a storm, it was like it was this morning. It was like super windy, rainy, like it was very nice. Um, and then I went and got my eyebrows done, which you can see, on they are on fluke. Now I can do lots of like eyebrow shapes and they are more dramatic. But yes, diversion. I have just um, scheduled the My Walt Disney World vlog for today. Yay, so it's the first one back in a long time. Rachel's trying to distract me behind the camera here. Um, it's my first one back in a long time. I don't think I've had a Walt Disney World vlog out since November because I stopped initially for Vlogmas and then I had this whole hard drive issue. She's like, what's this you're doing? You don't want to share it with everybody else? <laughs> you're such a child. And um, yeah, so that's going up today at four o'clock and I'm so excited to be back in this vlog series. And I actually didn't realize how few are already up because I'm only on day two now. So there's loads more Walt Disney World vlogs Where's coming soon. Day two? Oh, spoiler alert. <laughs> We did go to public on day two. Um, so yes, I will. My dad's like putting cutlery away in the background, hence all the noise. Um, I am gonna just be working away now for the afternoon, but I will catch you guys when I'm finished. So it is later on. I have just finished work and um, I think Buzz is happy to have someone to play with again. You having a good day? Yeah? So yeah, I'm just gonna chill for a bit, watch some TV, and we're gonna order um, Chinese for dinner, which is great. I love the Chinese back home in Ireland. It's so much better than the Chinese in the UK, or any of the ones that I've tried anyway. Indians are really good in London, but Chinese is not so much. What's happening, Buzz? Are you excited? Are we going for a walk? <laughs> are you excited? Come on, we're going for a walk. Yeah? Where are we going, Buzz? <laughs> He's so excited. Oh no, we forgot poo bags. And we are back this time with poo bags. <laughs> Let's go, Buzz. Where are you going? <laughs> Come on. He's so excited. Come on. Oh, it's so exciting, isn't it? We've got chili chicken, chow mein, chicken black bean, satay chicken and rice. And then we've also got chips. I'm not heading for the stars, driving down the boulevard at night. Playing cool, play on repeat, watching people on the street as I go by. 
good morning so it is saturday morning and um, we have just come out to sutton um which is along the coast and quite a bit away from where we live <laughs> it wasn't too far it's was like what half an hour 35 minutes and um we are going to get our hair done this morning so my friend actually um, runs a salon out here so that's why we've come all the way out here to get our hair done um i am getting it colored and cut and everything and i think what you're just getting a cut yeah so rachel's here by the way Hello. Good morning. Uh, we're just debating whether we go into the Starbucks before we go into the hair salon. Um, Starbucks is a lot more expensive in Ireland. We were just talking about this than in the UK. And they don't have that um, the app and like the loyalty scheme and everything that can make your coffees cheaper and stuff. Do you have so. a loyalty scheme. Oh, do you? Put the card. Oh, like card. So you get like a free drink after you get stamped. Yeah, yeah. Ah, but Not they don't have sure. an app. No. That's weird. I don't like it. Just home from having my hair done. And it's a bit darker than it was before, but I really like it. Look who it is! Oh, oh, I'm home! Are you excited? Are you excited? I'm so excited! So yeah, like I said, I've had my hair done. You can see, I just go into the natural light. It's really nice. It's like a little bit, I just brought the brain down a little bit more and then plans on the end. But like I said, my friend does my hair and she does it so well. So I love getting it done when I go home. Yeah, so I always have like a little bit of pump through when I come back to Ireland because my favourite like beautician is here in uh, the town where I live so I always get my eyebrows done and then my friend does my hair so it's like a little pamper session every time. Um, we are actually just watching the rugby now so Ireland are playing Scotland um, and we just scored a try which is great. Um, I won't vlog too much while that's on because let's just say it may not be very family friendly. <laughs> Um, I am actually going to start editing um, or finish editing my last Shanghai vlog so I'm hoping that will go up this weekend as well but if it's not it'll be up very soon yeah so it's been a really nice weekend like these weekends always go so fast which is just really annoying um, I always think like I've got loads of time and have loads of plans to do loads of things but like when I get home I just want to relax and spend time with the family and then before I know it the weekend is over so um, my mom's just making a nice dinner for later we're all just going to sit in and chill and then my flight tomorrow is quite early it's at like 12 in the day so I really don't have tomorrow which is like the morning time so what have I got for you Buzz? Aww. sit down sit down oh lie down Lie down. Sit down. Pa. No, pa. No, calm down. Sit down. Pa. There we go. Other pa. And lie down. There, there we go. Good boy. <laughs> no way with. Someone is very sleepy, but doesn't want to allow himself to have a sleep. Isn't that right, Buzz? Look, his little tongue sticks out as well when he's tired. He's relaxed, he just lets a little bit of tongue stick out. <laughs> oh, and the rugby's over, and we won. Yay! Hmm? Hi, Buzz. Somebody sleepy? Oh, I think he is. Very sleepy. We've got Jessica Ron on the, on the TV right now. <laughs> I think it's like we're all a bit tired tonight, aren't we? We've just really sat around doing nothing, watching TV. We have just had quite a chilled evening this evening. I've got my um, really nice Victoria Secret pajamas on. Rachel got me them for Christmas. Uh, she actually got me and my mum matching pairs, and her. So yeah, the three of us have the same pajamas, and um, we are just. All sort of clear enough to go to bed now. But going to say good night to Buzz before we head off. Night, Buzz. Oh, someone's very awake all of a sudden. Is that because it's cold outside? I think so. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, hey. Good night. <laughs> He's lying down. So cute. Good morning. It is now Sunday. I'm talking very quietly because everybody else is still in bed. I am just getting myself ready. I'll leave for the airport in like an hour and a half. It's like quarter to nine now, I think. But I'm gonna go in and get Buzz up and get him fed. Oh, good morning. Hi. That's a big old stretch. <laughs> we get you out. 
Oh, I think so. Somebody is waiting for their food. We've put it in the hot water, but we have to let it cool down. Yeah, Rachel was saying you tried to do uh, solid food, but um, no, he eats it too fast, yeah. so he chokes. I was trying to slow him down, like, but he just eats so fast. He knows that I've made his food, so he's just coming and sitting by me patiently. Or else he's diving all over me, trying to get my attention. I know, Buzz. You're being very well behaved. You're definitely going to get fed. Definitely. Promise you. Look, your little bit of tongue is ready, is it? Getting it ready for some food? <laughs> so cute. It's where we never fed you. What's going on? What are you so excited about? <laughs> What's going on, Buzz? Let's see how it's doing, eh? This is the... Food, give it a stir. Oh, yeah, it's grand. You ready? You ready for your food? You gonna sit? Good boy. Now you stay there. Stay. Stay. My food is here. Stay. Go eat your food. <laughs> to go and I'm gonna hit the road tonight so I am um, at the airport now say goodbye to everybody <laughs> it's always sad um, I am home again in a month so it's not too bad and my dad's actually over with me in like a week and a half and then my sister's over like a week later after he leaves and then I'm home for St. Patrick's weekend and then my man comes over so I'm actually getting to see everybody a lot but it's always so sad saying goodbye um, especially when we've got little buzz to say goodbye to as well so he was so cute it's like as if dogs know these things because he was like giving me loads of attention this morning and then like when I was getting ready and I went to like pick up my bag he like jumped on top of my bag with his two paws as if to say like no I can't go <laughs> Um, so I've just been at the airport for a little bit um, I, did, I don't really get to the to Dublin airport too early when I have a flight because like security is always pretty straightforward and like I'm only 20 minutes from the airport so yeah I was, I was here just about just over an hour before my flight um, and security was a breeze so it's grand. I just come down to the gates, had a little bit of something to eat. Oh, I don't know why but I always end up like picking stupid things to eat at the airport. Like I got this like wrap thing that was so messy and so I'm like there's that like you know when you're surrounded by everybody at the gate and I'm like trying to just like eat my messy wrap and like get it everywhere. But um, I ate it over the bag so I don't think I got anything because I just, my mom, <laughs> didn't you love when you go home like and your parents do your washing free? My mom did my washing and she washed this um, Hollister jumper. And a few other things, like all my clothes in my bag are looking clean, which is great. Um, but yeah, I didn't want to get it dirty because I've just got it washed, so I was like eating over the bag. So this is our plane here. So they've started to board at the gate, but they haven't actually started to let people out onto the plane yet. So what happens is they'll like board them through this gate back here, and you sort of get like held on the stairs down to the gate until they actually start letting people out so sometimes I just prefer to like wait till I see people starting to board the plane before I bother to even get in line to board the plane so there you go there's some Ryanair Ryanair boarding tips for you if you don't like to be stood wait in then don't go straight through the gate when they start boarding because you will inevitably get held because what they do is as soon as the plane actually pulls into the gate they'll start boarding um, and then they'll get to a point where they can't board anymore because everybody's stuck because they're not actually being let outside onto the plane yet so there you go um, and I just don't like that I can't be bothered like standing oh here we go they're starting toward now so now I can see there's people crossing over so you can see everybody's starting to board the plane so this line over here should start moving shortly and I will jump in it I think I've mentioned before but um, I have YouTube premium which is like the YouTube premium subscription service and um, so what I like to do then is just download uh, YouTube videos for the plane so I've got quite a few downloaded which is good and um, it's just fun to be able to like watch YouTube videos when you don't have signal because I just find lately I've just not had a whole lot of time to like catch up on every these vlogs so having YouTube premium means I can watch them on the tube and I can watch them like when I'm flying and stuff so I just um, use the airport Wi-Fi to download a few Ooh, just dropping my jacket there and um, I just use the airport Wi-Fi to download a few before I get on the plane so yeah I'll be spending my plane journey watching YouTube videos it's only a one-hour flight from Dublin to London so 
it's pretty handy um and then yeah i don't really have much fun for the rest of the evening i think i'm literally just going home and having um a nice chill done but i will catch you guys either on the probably not on the plane because like ryanair flights you are quite close together so um I don't think I'll be vlogging on the plane. Um, but what I will do is maybe vlog on my Sunset Express on the way um, in. I've got first class Sunset Express, and I think I've explained this before. The reason that I get first class Sunset Express is because it includes the Stansted um, priority security. And Stansted security is so hit and miss. Like sometimes it's all right, but sometimes it's an absolute nightmare. So um, the security itself, like if you just pay for the fast track security, it's like, maybe seven quid and usually the first class ticket's only like 10 quid extra so it's only three quid really for um the first class train ticket on top of the security long-winded way of explaining so i have made it onto the stansted express and um, it was actually quite busy today um on the train it's not where i am there's literally nobody here which is why i am vlogging so freely so i'm in the first class section um the only real difference with uh first class is that the seats will hold on the seats are a little bit nicer and um, they're a lot more comfortable and stuff um I don't know why I'm doing that, like you can't see over there, that's off the camera. <laughs> um, the seats are a little bit more comfortable. Um, and also the other thing, like I said before, is that you get the um, fast track security on your way to Stansted Airport. Um, but also this is the big benefit, which is that the carriage is always like a lot quieter than the main carriages. So I thought I would just do like a little, um, I guess wrap up right now because um, I am basically just gonna spend the rest of the evening chilling and um, there's some football on, there's some rugby on and yeah. And Sunday night for me, like when I've got work and work is really busy, Sunday night for me, I just wanna like switch off from everything. Um, and it's probably why I haven't really done like weekend vlogs before because I just feel like on a Sunday, I don't really have a lot to vlog normally. The fact that I was traveling today, I probably had a little bit more than usual, but Sunday for me is like my switch off day. I'll watch like vlogs and stuff like that, um, but I just, yeah, I just, I know like I can feel already that like my brain is trying to tick over into that like Monday morning thinking and I'm like, no, I need to savor every last minute of my Sunday. Um, so yeah, anyway, the point of that being that I think I will um, wrap up this vlog here. Um, I had such a lovely weekend back home. It's always so nice to go back home. And um, I've been good this year at like making sure that I schedule trips in advance because I like to go home like sort of every month, like every six weeks max, like six weeks is kind of like my limit for when I want to uh, have not had a trip home. So um, yeah, every six weeks. But if I don't do it in advance, like things start popping up and then I end up not having as much free time or free weekends. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to be really good this year about booking in advance. So I am coming back in like four weeks time on St. Patrick's weekend, which is also my mom's birthday. And when I come back, I'm running a, a 5K. I'm not running a 5K, I'm running a 10K um, on St. Patrick's day. So uh, that'll be pretty cool. Yeah, I had a nice time. Um, and I hope you have enjoyed watching. Uh, let me know below if you like, like these kind of like lifestyle vlogs. I haven't really decided exactly what I'm gonna do with like, what sort of format I'll do. Will I keep like weekend vlogging? Maybe try some week, week, weekly vlogging? week vlogging weekly vlogging i'm just not sure yet um so i'd appreciate if you could let me know what you think and yeah thank you so much for watching thank you very much if you made it to the end <laughs> and i will see you real soon bye